As a society, we've become very wasteful. Cheap imported plastic products thrown out without a moment's notice. A sobering estimate is that by the year 2050, there will be the equivalent weight of 1.8 billion African elephants of plastic waste in the environment. And as a father of two young children, I'm worried about their future, so I want to do something. Starting with takeaway disposable coffee cups. Can you imagine a Melbourne tram filled with them to the brink? That's how many go into landfill in Australia every 30 minutes. That represents 1.2 billion cups per year, with cafes spending over 100 million on cups that just get thrown out. Now, BYO cups are great, but they're having a very low impact. Why? Because people find them inconvenient. They don't like having to carry them around. They never have them with them when they're at a cafe. They don't like having to wash them, and they're expensive. But in Germany, it's different. Recup, the world leader in reusable returnable cups, has over 1,300 cafes in their network. And that's why we're partnering with them to bring their learnings to Australia. We call it the cup swap, and it's simple. <coughs> Step one, turn up at your cafe as normal, and rather than taking a disposable cup, take your coffee in a reusable cup swap cup. Pay a small deposit, and off you go. Step two, Bring the cup back at your convenience, whenever it suits you, and either swap it for another cup, for your, for your next cup of coffee, or get your deposit back. If you're a little bit slack like me and they pile up on your desk, just bring back 10 at once. There's a really no reason to use a disposable. Step three, the cups are washed and they're redistributed for circulation. Now, each one of these cups can last at least 500 times, meaning one of these cups takes 500 out of landfill. Seems to make sense, doesn't it? Our team brings a wealth of experience. I'm Luke Coulter. I've got over 15 years of broad corporate experience, including having built and grown a B2B-focused corporate-backed startup. We have Rob Soros, who has a wealth of experience in helping organisations to measure both social and financial impact, and Andrew Koch, with over 20 years of plastics engineering importation experience. We're initially targeting corporates because that's where we can have the most impact most quickly. Just an example to illustrate that. One Victorian university across all their campuses in Victoria, 750,000 disposable cups go into landfill every year. It is staggering. Um, but that's not the end. After that, we're going to go after the whole $100 million market to look to dis displace disposable cups by rolling out a low-cost subscription model targeted at cafes. But we don't just sell cups, because this is about more than cups. This is about helping to manage the change. So we help organisations, cafe operators, and consumers with that change, including education and marketing, and helping to manage the, measure the impact. Our business model is fairly simple. So around 10 cents per, per cup use, um, which is cheaper than the cost of a disposable cup and we retain ownership of the cup so that we can ensure they're recycled at end of life. For an organisation, this program pays for itself. You look at the, the university example. We're talking about over $100,000 they spend every year on disposable cups. That more than offsets the cost of our program. Now, there's a, a number of entrants that have entered this market, which is great, because we want people to solve this problem as well. It's about the impact. We remain differentiated as cup swap. Uh, with our focus on organisations rather than individual consumers or cafe operators. We're cup swap, uh, delivering reusable returnable cups to fight the war on waste, and we'd love to catch up over a coffee, particularly when it doesn't involve cups going to landfill. So please reach out if you know any change makers within organisations, because we'd love to chat. Thanks.